Welcome, Welcome to another episode of Christian, Christian Crafter Noon. <laughs> well, today we will be crafting a parting of the Red Sea Jello. Oh. We uh, mixed up our strawberry Jello and refrigerated it overnight, so you'll want to do the same. And it's been inverted now for, oh, I'd say a good four hours, and it will not let go. Oh my goodness, Sam. I think Satan has a hand in today's craft. <laughs> I think you're right. Oh, so, well, what's we your tip? Need, well, I think we need to pray over it. Put right. your hands okay. on it. We need to pray. Oh, Heavenly Father, please. Please, the camera is rolling. Let this jello let go. Yes, yes. Let the jello go. <sighs> All right. Well, well, it must be his will. All right. Yes. Well, that's where a that's, spatula comes that's in. Right. Oh, here comes. <gasps> oh, oh, let me scoot it. Okay. I think. Oh, oh a I don't know oh, if it's going to. Oh, it's structural integrity. Damn oh. you, Satan. We I'm so had an disappointed. That's okay. We can still do this. All right. Well, you know, the Aww. sea is not uniform. It's it's a turbulent sea. Yeah. Oh, I do I love know. It's strawberry so good. jello. I love strawberry yes. jello. Yes. Okay. All right. So we're going to create our dividing line. Okay. Good. Just as the Lord divided the sea. Yes. And again, right. let's remind viewers of let's. the story in the Bible. Um, there was something about some Israelites. They were slaves under Pharaoh for, uh, I think, like 50 right. years or 400 years. And then Noah came along. No? Maybe it was Moses. Or maybe they worked together. I, I don't know. That's not the point of the story. That's right. Yes, that's right. But Pharaoh was asked, let my people go. And he said right. no. So what did the Lord do? He unleashed the, the ten plagues. Yes. Oh, and they were awful. They were. Awful. I uh, just can't uh, imagine being locals. surrounded by locusts. Oh. And, but first, the water turned to blood. That'd be okay. I mean, not that I would desire it, but I mean, given locusts and blood water, I'd well, take blood water any okay, day. Okay, I I'm see your sorry, point. You know. All right. I mean, we just want our viewers to know what the plagues were. Lice, boils, locusts, water turned to blood, gingivitis, uh, lactose intolerance, that's mm -hmm. how lactose intolerance was unleashed upon the earth. And that is why people of Mediterranean descent often have lactose intolerance. And I think nearsightedness Including too. myself, that's right, nearsightedness. Yeah. yeah, so it was a lot. It's a lot to deal with. When you're... And then finally, Pharaoh said, you know, when that final plague was unleashed of bunions for all, he was like, enough. Oh, I'm going to let the Israelites go. And they went. All, all right. right. They were escaping with Moses or Noah. So I think that's enough setup. Whichever. Okay. Okay. So okay. we need to get to the craft and, okay. path. <laughs> okay. She drinks and she talks, I tell you. So the Israelites so. made their way. They were crossing. No, they hadn't yet crossed. And then they noticed, uh-oh, Pharaoh changed his mind, and he sent his soldiers out with their chariots. Like, hey, bring back my free, unpaid slave labor. And that's where oh. Moses or Noah, whichever one it was, yeah, said, he said, stay calm, everybody. Keep calm, carry on. And he asked the Lord to part the Red Sea. I didn't and that, know that's, that's where that that's came right. from. That I came always from see that those t-shirts, and I was wondering. That's what that is that's alluding what it to. Is. It's a Red Sea shirt. That's okay. right. Okay, so the that. Lord just kind of... I love it when you do that. <gasps> you pull your side. Oh! <laughs> Okay, so All right. get us the, the Romans and yes, their chariots. Yes, there we go. All right, so the Romans came in their chariots. All right, and the Romans. Two and by their two. All these heretics. Two by two. I just love yeah, the they had ch uh, chariots drawn by hippopotami. Mm -hmm. And um, they were coming toward. Now, the Israelites had already crossed to safety. And the Romans were crossing the sea yeah, two, by two, two by two. Yes, this is right. where that comes from. So they had to have two of everything. That's yeah. right. So he slowed right. them down, and when all the the Romans and their chariots were in the middle of the sea, he went. <gasps> oh, 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 I love this part. oh, and the, oh, the, oh, the Romans mm. died, but so did the animals. <laughs> Oh, I didn't realize that. Oh. oh. What did they do wrong? 
I mean, that's kind of sad. I guess they, they worked for the really wrong team. This. I guess so. Well, it was the Lord's will. I guess it's all right. So, all right, so now, Steve and I, when we were both independently as children, <laughs> we were both champion piggy contest winners. We were. <laughs> it was fabulous. And for those of you who didn't grow up in the Midwest, a piggy contest is where you secure your hands behind your back and right. you eat jello without the use of your hands. You ready? All right? Ready? Should we show them? Ready? And go! Oh, no. <coughs> oh, what kind of big one in my mouth? 